girl sent you hallelujah. Girl sent you hallelujah. Cause Uptown Funk don't give it to you. Why does Michelle Obama, an American attorney, author, and former first lady, seem to defy the aging process? At 60, she's not just turning heads, she's spinning them 360 degrees. Now, it might be easy to chalk up her youthful appearance to wealth and a sprinkle of affluence, but hold your horses. This isn't just a story of riches leading to radiance. Long before the spotlight found her, Michelle was all about treating her body and mind like a temple. From the kale on her plate to the squats for her glutes, she's been on a lifelong mission to keep both her physique and psyche in tip-top shape. So what's her secret potion? It's not just about the green smoothies. Join us as we dive into the world of disciplined diets, dedicated workouts, and the determination to empower the next generation, all wrapped up in the Michelle Obama enigma. All of this is the kind of movement, and this is way more fun than sitting in front of the TV, am I right? Is it just the magic of healthy living, or is there more to her fountain of youth? Let's find out, and maybe, just maybe, we'll uncover some tips to look and feel decades younger ourselves. No White House required. And she jumped right in there to show off some of her own skills. Now, at first, she kind of tripped, and she is in high heels. Give her a break. In a world where fries chase down salads and donuts have a sneaky way of replacing apples, one woman stands tall, armed with kale and quinoa, ready to wage war on junk food. Enter Michelle Obama, erstwhile first lady and current champion of the dinner plate. For too many families, uh, limited access to healthy foods and vegetables is often a barrier to a healthier diet. In so many of our communities, particularly in poor and more isolated communities, fresh healthy food is simply out of reach. Her message? Indulge in moderation, my friends. Life isn't about saying no to the slice of pizza or the scoop of ice cream. It's about high-fiving the broccoli and fist-bumping the quinoa on your way there. Remember, it's not the occasional treat that tips the scales. It's when those treats start setting up camp in your daily routine. I love sweet potatoes, I love broccoli, and you know what, I love them when they're put on a pizza. I love veggie pizza. Don't be fooled. Behind Michelle's mission to make America much healthier is a schedule that would make lesser mortals weep into their prepackaged salads. Despite juggling the demands of being in the relentless spotlight and managing a calendar that's probably more packed than a double stuffed cookie, Michelle at 60 still manages to outshine her younger self. It's all thanks to her devout following of the gospel, according to Veggies. So as we sit spoon in hand, staring down at our cereal and wondering about the secrets to her vigor, one can't help but ponder, what magic concoction of food does Michelle Obama consume to look like she's found the fountain of youth in a vegetable patch? The breakfast table at the former first lady's residence is nothing short of a gold medal ceremony with eggs always taking the podium. Hailed as the nutrient-packed heavyweights of the food world, these easy-to-prepare champions are a staple in Michelle Obama's morning routine. It's no small feat, juggling the dizzying demands of public life, yet Michelle still cracks the code, whipping up hearty meals for herself and her loved ones. It's her way of showing that leading by example isn't just a catchphrase. It's scrambled, poached, or boiled into every decision she makes. Her fondness for scrambled eggs isn't just about taste, it's a protein-packed pep talk, ensuring everyone at the table is ready to leap into the day with energy to spare. Michelle Obama transforms the ordinary oatmeal breakfast into an extraordinary feast of flavors. For her, a bowl of oatmeal isn't just a dish, it's a canvas waiting to be painted with vibrant fruits and crunchy nuts, proving that a little creativity can turn boring into soaring on the flavor meter. This power-packed grain makes frequent appearances in her breakfast lineup, championing her commitment to a nourishing start to the day. Then enter the grapefruit, a fruit that divides the crowd with its unique blend of sweetness and bitterness. Yet for Michelle, it's a breakfast staple, a bold choice that showcases her flair for embracing the full spectrum of flavors. This citrus gem with its fiber and antioxidants is Michelle's secret weapon for maintaining her vibrant health and youthfulness. 
for Michelle, much is like stepping into the ring with a heavyweight champion and her contender of choice, a robust turkey chili, flexing with protein and flanked by a loyal entourage of salad or the stoic yet ever so green steamed broccoli. When it comes to snacking, rest assured, the former first lady enthusiastically endorses it. Yet in the realm of nibbles and bites, Michelle Obama steers the ship with a keen eye for nutrition, ditching the siren call of cookies she sails toward the safe harbors of nuts and veggies, ensuring her snack time is as smart as it is satisfying. Michelle might not have an initial blacklist of foods. Still, she navigates the culinary world like a seasoned captain steering clear of foods high in sugar, unhealthy fat, and processed food. It's less about banning specific dishes and more about keeping a wary eye on anything that looks like it might have spent too much time in a chemistry lab rather than a kitchen. But don't think it's all about the do's and don'ts of dining for Michelle. The who, how, and why of her eating habits play just as big a role as the what. Even amid the pump of the White House, she was out there, trowel in hand, tending to her vegetable garden like a modern day agricultural superhero, ensuring her table was always graced with the freshest of the fresh vegetables. They would use the stalk of the corn as a way to facilitate growth of other vegetables. So I think we're, I think that's one of the goals. And when it comes to the principles of her diet, it's all about the golden rule of moderation. Michelle's approach to eating is like being at a party where every food is invited, but no one's allowed to get out of hand. It's all about enjoying the dance of flavors on your plate, but stopping short of a full-blown food conga line. Yes, she's all for the occasional cheat day, because what's life without a little indulgence? But even then, it's about savoring, not splurging. After all, in the grand feast of life, Michelle Obama is living proof that you can have your cake in moderation and eat it too. Walking 30 minutes a day, maybe five days a week, and starting with your kids on a different set of habits, those things will eliminate obesity. Michelle Obama has always been known for her love of fitness and toned arms. Ah, the legendary Michelle Obama arm workout, a phenomenon so renowned it almost broke the internet, like her much famed vegetable garden almost broke the internet at the White House. Want arms that effortlessly juggle the responsibilities of being a former first lady and a fitness icon? Then it's time to dive into the depths of YouTube and emerge with the secret scrolls of the Michelle Obama arm sculpting routine. Michelle's approach to fitness is as disciplined as her efforts to get kids eating their greens. Combining the heart-pumping thrill of cardio, the sweat-inducing thrill of HIIT, and the muscle-building thrill of strength training, her regimen is tailored to her body demands at the moment. An early bird catching the workout worm, she's up before the crack of dawn at 4.30 a.m. Why? Because according to her, the sun has a lazy habit of oversleeping when you've got fitness goals to smash. She begins with low impact exercises to wake her body up. Jumping jacks, push-ups, and sit-ups, all for one minute each. Then she repeated the circuit 10 times for a total of 30 minutes. Next, she goes for more high intensity circuit exercises like jump ropes, ab exercises, and jump squats. She then delves into the various exercises that sum up her arm workout routine. For the overhead triceps extension, she stands and holds the dumbbells without resting her elbows toward the ceiling. Then she extends her arms straight into the air, dropping them behind her head. Next is the skull crusher, where she lies flat on the floor, a bench or an exercise ball, tightening her core, hips and glutes. Holding a five to 15 pound dumbbell in each hand, she starts with hands at her ears, elbows pointed toward the ceiling. Then she extends weights toward the ceiling by straightening her elbows. As for those arms that have sparked envy and admiration in equal measure, the secret sauce includes a hearty serving of overhead tricep extensions, where she sits on a bench or a chair with the dumbbell in her right hand. She presses her elbow against the inside of her thigh, allowing her arms to fully extend toward the floor, then curl it back up towards her. She adds that each workout must be repeated 10 to 12 times for better results. Remember, it's 10 to 12 reps of dedication, perseverance, and maybe a little bit of wishing you were done already. But hey, in the quest for Michelle Obama's arms, every curl counts. Recently, Michelle Obama threw a curveball into her fitness regimen like a plot twist in a sitcom. She reveals she switched things up a little. In a daring move, she dove headfirst into the world of swimming and stretched into the realm of yoga. Why this aquatic and zen-filled adventure, you ask? 
Well, it seems the march of time and a global pandemic, COVID-19, turned her workout routine on its head. During the workout, I turned into a self-taught aquatic aficionado, she shared with a chuckle. You see, as the calendar keeps flipping closer to the big 60, those high-flying, knee-slapping workouts of yesteryears have started to feel more like a morning after a wild party. Fun in theory, but painful in practice. So I figured, why not try swimming? It's like cardio, but you get to lie down in water. Yes, Michelle O found her splash of inspiration amidst the global standstill, embracing the gentle, buoyant embrace of water to keep fit. Turns out, she added, swimming is the perfect match for someone looking to stay active without playing a live action game of floor is lava with their joints. The former first lady's achievements and accomplishments are too numerous to mention. Michelle Obama served as a role model for women and worked as an advocate for poverty awareness, education, nutrition, physical activity, and healthy eating. The Girl Opportunity Alliance, a brainchild of the Obama Foundation, seeks to empower adolescent girls around the world through education, allowing them to achieve their full potential. The Let's Move initiative, equally launched by her, is dedicated to solving the problem of obesity within a generation so that children born today will grow up healthier and able to pursue their dreams. Her latest venture, Pleasy Nutrition, is aimed at creating healthy food and beverage options for parents to give healthier, great-tasting products to their kids. An author of several works, her bestseller Becoming has sold more than 14 million copies worldwide. Michelle Obama enjoys swimming and spending time with family when she isn't granting interviews or traveling.